This video explains how to load multiple packages at once in the R programming language. So without much talk, let's dive into the R code. So let's assume that we want to load the packages dplyr, mice and string r. Then we could load these packages one by one, as you can see in lines 2 to 4 of the code, by applying the library function to each of the packages. However, we could also specify a vector that contains the name of all packages that we want to use. And we can do that as you can see in line six of the code. So after running this line of code, a new data object called my packages is appearing at the top right. And this data object contains a vector that contains character strings that identify the names of our packages that we want to load. And then in the next step, we can use the lapply function. And within the lapply function, we need to specify the vector object that contains our package names. Then we need to specify require and we need to specify character.only to be equal to true. So after running line eight of the code, all of our packages are imported. And you can also see some output at the bottom, which is returned by the lapply function. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on my homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.